This needs to come out. So yeah, now you see why she is a breeder queen. I mean, all my girls are like this. I'm just selecting the best on being calm, as you can see. Those girls were aggressive. I mean, those are bee weavers. Not as bad as they usually are. The other bee weavers were really nice. One got me. <laughs> When I was putting the sugar brick, probably I, I drop it on her. But this, this is a wonderful size going into winter. The thing with this size is we to make sure that they have enough resources. And enough resources is going to be me helping them out. Here, remember, bees don't like it, the heat of your hand. But it's cold, so maybe they like it in the rain. <laughs> no, they don't. No, they like your bread, but I don't want them to stain me or anything. See how calm they are? All right, we gotta move them. I love my girls. I really do. They're awesome. All right. So feeding shame done. Soft sugar break done. Inner cover. With moisture board, done. Then I don't have any more shims for insulation, so I'm using a medium frame with the insulation there. I mean, I'm not using the mediums in, in winter, so might as well use them instead of spending money making more shims. Everything very nice, highly packed down. Okay, so there it is, this is it. And here, I put the cover with the um, reflectives, which reflected arm space is a good combination for insulation. Woohoo, it rhymes. So this is good. I just need it not to move when I put the cover. I'm done. Because I don't have my wax sealant, I put in tape in case there's any spaces or crevices in between the shims and the frames and everything.